I'm Bill Chapman and I'm the general manager of the Oakhurst Inn here next to the university. Oakhurst Inn is a 27 room boutique hotel that opened uh, three years ago. My name is Saili Gonzalez Velazquez. I am from Cuba and there I manage a bed and breakfast. The name is Amarillo Inn. Amarillo Inn is a modern facility where we offer three rooms for the guests of all the world. We have a lot of experience here hiring international staff because we work with the International Rescue Committee. So we've had employees here from Afghanistan, Iraq, the Congo, things like that. So that's great for the hotel because uh, it gives us international flair. And I thought the idea of having a young entrepreneur from Cuba sounded great. Um, we're a small business, Saley runs a small business and hopefully it helps her out and hopefully we can learn some things from her. So for me it's very important, it's very important to have this uh, experience here because we are listed in Airbnb. Right now here to see all this, to see the, the hotels and how works the business of the hospitality here in the United States for me has been great and I have a lot of ideas that I can apply to my, to my own business. One of the first ideas that I have was here in Ockers because in Ockers they serve in the night some cookies to the guests that is great and the people really appreciate it. Uh, yesterday I was in the graduate hotel and I realized that they have like bicycles too <laughs> for the guests and this is amazing because in Cuba everyone has bicycles and it's easy for me to give offer a bicycle to my guests. We're bringing customers into a sort of intimate space here because it's a residential setting, small buildings, small rooms, very face-to-face -face contact at the front desk. Um, and she does that. She's actually bringing people into her home where she's carved off some bedrooms to be hotel rooms. This is the, the first time that I travel in my life. And the first city of the United States that I visited was Dallas. And Dallas was interesting, but Charlottesville is just beautiful. I was kind of an accidental entrepreneur. I, I wanted to be a writer and editor when I was in high school and college. And the way I found to do that was to start a newspaper. The idea of doing a site visit to another business is a great idea. These guys are doing the extreme version of that, leaving their home country and staying in the US for a month but not everyone can do that. Go across town and visit other businesses. Go to the next town and visit businesses. Get to know your competitors, be friends with them, see what they do, decide what you want to do differently. Being a, a woman entrepreneur is, is more than great because we live in this uh, world dominated by men. By men. <laughs> but it's, it's amazing because you really feel powerful you really feel uh, able to, to accomplish any, any task.